Hi, hello. In this video, we're going to talk about copyright claims. We're going to talk about how it works. I'm going to give you a short interview how everything works. So let's begin. First thing is important to understand what copyright is and how it works. So uh, I'm going to show you how it works and then we're going to discuss the copyright claims. What you need to know is copyright is a right. When you design something, when you create something, you have copyright on it. The question is, what are you going to do with it? When someone uses your work without your permission, you can sue the person. If you use the work for someone else without the permission, they can sue you. And that's a copyright claim. How does it work? Normally you have a work, let's call it A. Normally you have a work A and the person that owns the work, so we call it B. So this is the person, he owns the work and C is you. You're using the work without the permission. So this is the person, C use the uh, work without the permission. And if you don't have a permission, you have a problem. If you have a permission, you're good to go. There's nothing to worry about. Sometimes you can buy permission by buying a license. Sometimes people give, um, you, you're allowed to use the work for free if you give an attribution. It depends what kind of copyright it is. So how does it work? Normally when you create something, it can be a logo, it can be a website, it can be everything. You have copyright on it. What you need to know is look for the rules of copyright in the country. If someone created uh, something in the US, most of the time the US laws apply. If someone created in Europe, depends what kind of country they created the, the, the thing. If it's in the Netherlands, then the Netherlands law apply. So what you need to know is figure out which country it is. So if you get a copyright claims, you need to figure out if they have a copyright. So you need to figure out, do the person that's claimed that have a copyright, have a copyright? Most of the time they can prove that by showing they were first of a reg reg registration paper, whatever. But they need to prove that they have the copyright. Otherwise they don't have a claim. It's that simple. So how does it work? If they prove that they have a copyright, so they have an A, so B proved that they have a copyright, then you need to figure out um, if you are you are using their work or not, simple say. So what you need to do is in that case, look for a legal advisor. Because if the if you get a letter with an um, with some evidence in it and some uh, from a lawyer or anything, look for legal advice. That's my advice to you. Because most of the time you can find information on the internet but you don't have any experience with it. But simply put you have a work if they claim that you're using their work they need to prove that they had the work and they also need to prove that you are using the work so if you get a claim and someone saying you're using the picture remove the picture and um, figure out if they have a copyright on the picture or not so how does the claim work most of the time you have someone that creates something can it be a picture website anything they can register so they can always prove that they are first if they don't register they need to prove um, on a different way that they were first so the person um, needs to have the copyright and when they have the copyright they need to uh, make sure that they can prove that you are using the work without permission you are using the picture without permission and if they cannot prove those things you don't have anything to worry about but if they can prove you have a problem, what you need to do is look for legal advice. That's my advice to you. So step by step, what you need to do is figure out when you receive a copyright claim. One, do they have a copyright? Two, can you, is it possible to get them uh, permission? Can you um, look around um, for license that they're giving? Most of the time they're saying you're allowed to use the picture with attribution. Most of the time they say, you're allowed to use the picture for free so that's what you can do and second in the letter they need to can prove or 
um, yeah, make it solid that you're using their work without their permission. And when you do that, then you, when they do that, then you have a problem. Then you have a solid copyright claim. But if they don't do that, you don't have a solid copyright claim. My advice to you, look for a legal person, look for a lawyer, attorney, doesn't matter. Let them check the case and give your advice on it. If you have a question about copyright or you receive a claim and you want to know more about it, feel free to contact me. See you in the next video.